objective. Oh god, no! Son of a... Nyeh. Hello everybody, and welcome back to Sonic Origins. I'm Kiru Khan, and thank you for joining me. Okay, so, like I was saying before, I think Sonic 2 is kind of my least favorite of the classic games, just because of how long it is without any chance to stop. I should actually say Quadrilogy, because Sonic CD, which also had a save feature, and that's heckin' awesome. A, a lot of it really is just a stigma against Sonic 2, because, you know, classic versions. Because I'm old! Back in my day, we didn't have save states and, uh, load screens. And other stuff that's really, really improved gaming. It's not that Sonic 2 is a super long game, but I do think it's a little too long to, uh, uh sit and play a lot once. At least in a lot of cases. I don't need another bubble. I just need to be smart. Which, you know, is far beyond my abilities. But, uh... Forgot what I was gonna say. Uh, may maybe uh, with my next playthrough of Sonic 2, that opinion will change. The, the one I did with Chad's was pretty fun, but I, I think by the end of it I was feeling a little bit fatigued. I, I have played through it in Origins, just not recorded. First time I ever got all the Chaos Animals. First time I legitimately beat the final boss. A lot of that is thanks to the coin system. Oh boy. Ah! No, 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 no! No! Where am I going? This way. Ah! Yeah, right there! Eh! No! Get fucked, you stupid bumper! Who put you there? Oh, no. Ah! No. No, no! Ah! Gravity! You suck! Shit. Ah! Seriously, who, who created these vomit-inducing special stages? Naka, was this you? This is the real reason you're in prison! I hope that joke wasn't in too poor taste. Okay. Oh god. No, no. Come on. No! Uh, who keeps putting the bumpers in the worst place? And now my nose is itching. Oh god, no, not now, nose. Not now! Ah! Uh, no! Crap! Oh, uh, I think it's spinning too fast to make it now. Oh, okay, it's load. It's load a lot. 
If it can just stay slow, that'd be really nice. No, it's speeding up again. And I think it slowed down. Okay. Come on, 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 Got it! Ah, oh, I can finally scratch my nose! Ah! Oh, that is the worst! Okay, that's better. Yes, I still think the half pipes are worse. I hate those so much. And I keep reusing them. Oh! That did not go like planned at all. But seriously, or Origins does make the half pipes much better. Because a lot of it is like you have to know that shit is coming. It becomes less uh, a case of, hey, a person can totally make it through all of these on their first try without knowing what's ahead. I, I genuinely think that... Whoa! I genuinely think that a lot of the half-pipe stuff is it, just... If you don't know what's coming, you can never win. And then, uh, the blue spheres are a piece of cake. Like, I, I mess up from time to time, but in general, they're so easy. And then Sonic 3 has the wonderful, wonderful save system. Ah! And I almost did stupid things there. But, uh, yeah, Sonic 3, easy to get all of the M holds on. Sonic CD is a little bit tougher, but even in the old one, if you quit out before the completion screen cleared, then you could just retry. And, uh, of course that had a save system, which was really, really nice. But Sonic 1, it's a little bit irritating because, while it's a short game, there is no save system, and if you miss it... Well, if you miss the emeralds all the way up until Scrap Brain, then you just can't do it. Uh, once you're in Scrap Brain, if you don't have the six emeralds, you lose. Oh, crap! Okay. Ah! Then, um, yeah, I think it's just one and two where getting all the emeralds is kind of a bitch. I want that. Not gonna lie, even though it makes her, uh, really functionally similar to Sonic, I, I I am glad Amy has the roll and the spin dash. Oh, I could just run through there. I'm stupid. I think we're good. Oop! I, I hope you guys don't think that uh, when I'm complaining about the special stages that uh, and whatnot that I, I hate Sonic 1 and 2. I don't. I love both of those games. It, it's just that, you know, I, I do have preferences. In many ways, I do think Sonic 2 is the superior game to, uh, uh, Sonic CD. 
I, I think it has a better sense of speed, and the stages are a little bit, uh, you know, more active. Oh god, no! Son of a- Nyeh. Also, Tails. Tails was a really cool addition. Uh... I, I, I do think CD is cool in how it's... I wouldn't say non-linear, because it, it's not non-linear. Uh, but it's less linear? It, it, it's a very open game that rewards exploration. Which... You know, that's that's a great design philosophy. I, I just don't know if, with how open some of the stages are, that it's as good as, you know, some of the more linear Sonic games. That's the difficulty with Sonic. You don't want it too open, or it's kind of boring and empty space. But you don't want it too linear, or, you know, you wind up with Sonic Forces. I like Sonic Forces! But even I'm not going to pretend that the stage design wasn't full of, you know, really, 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 really bad, uh, design. Ah! Colors also had that issue, where some of the stages were just way too short and linear. In fact, I actually argue that Colors has lower lows than Forces, but it consistently has higher highs as well. That being said, I, I still really like Forces. It, I don't gotta justify it yet. I did anyway. But, uh... Oh, her waiting animation is adorable. Uh, but Forces, you know, I, I fully recognize that it is a game full of wasted potential, that they clearly had no clue what they were designing, and, and that it's a mishmash of, of, you know, incoherent ideas. But that being said, it, it's one of those games where I can just sit down and, and just Blitz through a huge chunk of the game you know, without really thinking. It, it, it's it's a comfort uh, game. Comfort food. Uh, uh, video games, if that makes any sense. It, it, it's something where sometimes I'll just, you know, decide, you know what, I want to waste a few hours. I'm just going to blitz through the CAC and Sonic levels. But not Classic Sonic, because he's not fun. Although I don't even... I, I actually think he probably has the best designed levels in the game, but he's also, like, the least fun character to play as. Oh god! I forgot that sank. Did it always sink? Was that in the original? I still hate Unleashed. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't resist <laughs> bringing it up sometimes. I, I I really, I really just do not like Unleashed. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to uh, those of you that do. If you enjoy it, more power to you. But the only version of Unleashed I like is the uh, standard definition version, the uh, PS2 slash Wii version, which I think is an awesome game. I, I actually heckin' love it. I do recognize that the daytime stages don't hit quite the same highs, although they're by no means bad outside of, like, the first two or three. Uh, but, uh... Like, e even the Werehog, I think, is pretty fun on PS2. I think a lot of it's because you don't sit there spending three-fourths of the game, uh, you know, in, in these absolute slogs of stages. Yeah, you, you still play more as the Werehog, possibly even, uh, more per ratio. Per ratio? Per scale? Whatever, you guys get what I mean. 
Oh, I don't like this pattern. Can I upscreen that? Try again. Yeah, that's that's a better pattern. But uh the the standard definition version of Sonic Unleashed. Uh so, since I did my original review, I did play all the way through it, I completed it, and I love it. That the, the PS2 version makes me happy. Cause it's got like most of the best stuff from the uh the uh, PS3 360 version, but you know with far less of the crappy stuff. I do think that there's some filler involved, but it's nowhere near as aggressive. Maybe someday you guys will get to see me play that. I actually did start recording a playthrough, but that was quite some time ago and I got distracted by other stuff. But I still would like to do it. Because again, I like that version of the game. That version's fun! And with that, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you come back for the next one. Whoa! Oh, I was not far enough over. Damn. And I'm going to die for sure. Or... Am I? Did I... Did I win?